guys, we built some barns this year, so I thought I'd give you a tour. So they're two 2,000 head nursery barns. So they get pigs straight off of the sows from our sow barn. We also make feed at the feed mill right there and blow it underground to that bin right there and then blow it the rest of the way over here. And it comes through that feed line and into the bins over here. So there's the feed bins there. Here's the pipes with the feed blowing through. We're blowing some right now. So when you get into the barn, there's a little bench here. We gotta leave our outside boots out here and put inside boots on when you cross that line. That's so we don't bring any diseases into the barn. We also have a shower here. We got a little workbench there. Here's all the room controls where we control the temperature. These are the controllers to turn the flex augers on and off that fill up the feeders. Washer, dryer, radio, fridge. This is a closet with a bathroom sink in it. That almost looks like you're going to put a toilet in there, but you're not allowed to have a toilet without a septic system. <laughs> no. <laughs> Let's go look over here. So this is the main hallway at the front of the barn. There's just two rooms of pigs in each barn. So you empty the room into this hallway and the pigs go out the loading chute door over there. So these guys are leaving uh, in two days. So they're about full size for this barn. Janet's doing chores in the other barn right now, so let's go over there and take a look. So we got a little generator shack between the two barns too. So it's got the incoming electrical service that splits and goes to each barn. Standby generator in case the power goes out. Pressure washer we still need to set up over there. And then just an area with a roll-up door for them to set bags of feed if we need them. Hello! So there's 30 to 35 pigs per pen in all these pens. We got water drinkers on the walls there, two nipple drinkers and one bowl drinker per pen, and then that's the feeder. Feeders are all filled with flex augers that run to those bins outside. So for the ventilation, fans running along this outside wall of each room, and they're pulling air through those black inlets there so the air comes in from the attic down into the room and then gets sucked out at the back of the rooms we have heat exchangers and they're preheating incoming air so the incoming air is coming down from the attic through these tubes back through the tube and up through this pipe and it comes out of the pipe into the room the exhaust air is getting sucked from the pit up past all these pipes and out a chimney fan through the roof. So the dirty air is coming up past the pipes and preheating the fresh air that's coming in to the barn. So here's the booster blower shack. Feet's filling that bin. Coming through this auger. Dropping out of the auger into the airlock, and that blower is blowing the feed through that pipe to the other barn. So it's not super fast, but it saves us from driving the feed over there with a feed truck. So, so that's it. Let me know if you have any questions.